Traveling Tyler style. Subscribe to my channel. I'm in Aqaba, Jordan. And I was just out, kind of wandering around. I stumbled into this market. I wasn't planning on recording this, but I couldn't believe how cool it was. This just goes on and on and on. Probably take like a half hour to walk from one side to the other, maybe even more. And look how cool the people are. It's really pretty incredible. I'm not a big shopper. I mean, I actually didn't buy anything. <laughs> but if you are a big shopper, this is the place. You can buy a little bit of anything. You can buy jewelry. You could buy dinner. You could buy clothes. <laughs> you could buy shoes, snacks, ice cream. Aqaba has to be one of the most underrated cities in the Middle East. One thing that's unique about it is the food is so cheap. You go eat dinner, you order a steak and a couple sides and you know, something along those lines and they bring you the tab and it's 6 JD, which is like $8. Back in the US, it'd be 25 bucks or more. Doesn't make any sense. I travel fairly frequently to Amman at least I have over the years, and I don't remember Amon being like that, so maybe it's just an Aqaba thing. It's also got a good location. You're like two hours outside of Petra, 40 minutes outside of Wadi Rum. Has a lot to offer. Look at this, it just keeps going and going. If you have a wife that likes to shop, you may want to consider keeping her away from this. <laughs> Aqaba, Jordan's a great place. Should be on everybody's list of places to go if you're in the Middle East. Traveling Tyler style. I'm out.